Adam Kokesh, I want to take a quick minute to address you. I can't get over Ron Paul's not going to be president video. Um, listen, man, you know, it, it's great that you're moving on and, and you're going to support the libertarian candidate. I mean, after all, you are a, a self-proclaimed libertarian. Um, but to do it now when, you know, the liberty movement is still clearly behind Ron Paul, we haven't voted at the convention yet, um, Romney, yeah, Romney. Romney hasn't been nominated yet. Um, you, you're doing a disservice to the movement, and you're actually, you're actually uh, dividing the movement on some level. I mean, honestly, my knee-jerk reaction to your um, telling people to move past Ron Paul a couple of weeks ago was, I would never have voted for Gary Johnson just out of spite because, you know, it, it, it seems like the Ron Paul train left the building, and, and you're, you're looking for your next gig. I, I don't really appreciate it, and, I, and you know, the Romney people, they, they they stripped Ron Paul of his plurality over the weekend. Did you know that? Yeah, they passed laws changing the rules so that it was no longer a five-state plurality. Now it needed to be eight states. Um, it's a crime. It's like It's like changing the rules of football 30 seconds left on the clock in the fourth quarter of the Super Bowl. It, it doesn't happen. And we are over on the RNC page on Facebook, in the trenches, tearing everybody that comes up, anybody that comes in there. We're tearing them up and letting them know uh, the guy that you're supporting is a cheetah. I mean, let's not even talk about the fact that Romney got, uh, he got funding from, he, he, he accepted donations from uh, foreign entities and stuff like that. Let's not talk about the, uh, the voter fraud in Iowa, the voter fraud in Maine, the voter fraud in Louisiana, in Nevada, and, and, and on and on. I, I couldn't even think of all the places that there was voter fraud. Um, let's not talk about the delegate fraud. Let's not talk about the, uh, 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 what about the guy in Louisiana that got his, his uh, uh, replaced hip dislocated when he was assaulted? I mean, what happened to the Adam Kokesh that said, we can do this the easy way or the hard way? I mean, you either believe in the Constitution, you believe in the Declaration of the Independence and, the, and what it mandates there, or you don't. I, I, I really don't know what else to say. Uh, I, I'm, I'm pissed. I'm upset. A lot of people are pissed and upset. And, you know, let's get past the convention before you try to, you know, woo us all and, and you know, try to bring us into the Libertarian Party. Uh, you know, a lot of people have fought hard. You are not the only person who are in this, that's in this movement, man. There, there are a lot of people out there that are working hard still. Still working hard. Not for Ron Paul. Not for, uh, the Republican Party. But to get the message out there. So doing what you're doing, it's, it's a fraction to the movement. If you want to be a libertarian, man, that's fine. All the power to you. Um, but, you know, Ron Paul hasn't moved over to the libertarian and endorsed Gary Johnson. And, and, and I don't know that he will. And I, I don't know if I would support Gary Johnson or not. But I'm not even going to look at Gary Johnson until after this whole thing has expired. Okay? So, you know, we, we have our... We have our uh, we got Paul Fest in Tampa. We got the uh, the RNC in Tampa. Why don't Why don't you do the decent thing and let it play out? I mean, you know, that's that's just what that's just my opinion. Take it or leave it. I don't I don't really care. You be you, I guess. But um, yeah, whatever happened to the we're gonna do this? We could do this the easy way or the hard way. It looks like you took the easy way. All right, peace.